by Marriott Isla Verde Resort, Beach Resort. This is the opening, the lobby when you walk in, when you pull in. Here we go. The first thing you notice is that beautiful fountain. Yeah, the landscape is beautiful. See some bikes over there? I believe I had read online that you can rent those bikes. And there is the um, LA service. Take you inside. Right there is front desk where you check in. Yesterday our wait wasn't too bad to check in considering it was kind of busy. Elevators. Great feature of this uh, resort is it has its own casino. It's not huge, but we can walk over there. Lots of uh, seating areas. And anywhere you look out a window, the view is amazing. This is a little spot to eat. They have some breakfast foods, some coffee, sandwiches, pastries. Do you remember the name of it? I know it's called banana something. I'll have to get back to you on that. But it's called banana. It says banana on the corner there, but it's called banana something else. Here's the casino. I said it's not too big, but actually I haven't been in it yet. So I don't know how far back it goes. So it might be big once you're inside. They have their own little gift shop. and glasses and flip-flops and towels and bags and typical gift shop things. And now we're going to take you to their restaurant. We had dinner last night um, right next to the beach and then we had breakfast this morning right next to the beach. So that was really nice. restrooms all the way more seating um this is called the picante lounge last night they had salsa music playing um not sure if you can get food here but there was quite a few people having drinks last night and again the music was playing it's a nice little spot they have meeting rooms over here is um cafe tropical that's where we had our breakfast we had a buffet breakfast we had pancakes, French toast, sausage, bacon, eggs, fruit, yogurt, bagels, bread. I mean, typical breakfast food, but I thought it was quite good. And it was a buffet um, included with our package. Our breakfast was free, um, so that's an option. Um, but definitely, even if we had paid, I would have said it was a good deal. All you can eat is buffet. Service was really nice. Um, and you could eat inside, or we ate outside because why wouldn't you with this view? So they have the outdoor seating. Yesterday, this was um, the Siena restaurant that we ate at. Mm -hmm. And um, I had um, arroz con abuelas and grilled chicken. And we had a burger and fries because, yeah. <laughs> um, and we sat out here. And our waitress was so sweet yesterday. And here we are at the beach. And you can see you could sit and be your view of the beach, which is pretty amazing. And this is the beautiful public beach, La Playa. Um, that goes pretty far. You got hammocks. You have seating, um, which is all free. I know some resorts you have to pay to reserve your chair, so this is pretty cool that it's free. Now these gazebos here um, are kind of closed off because I saw that you can rent the little gazebo and have like a little private dining experience, a little romantic dining experience. I believe it was like $215 where you sit at candlelight under the gazebo and have dinner. So that's a nice little option, romantic little option. Um, so that is a fee for that, but 
I would say at night under candlelight. Sounds worth it. <clears throat> um, but otherwise, these chairs, like I said, pretty sweet deal because they're free. And usually at most resorts, you have to pay and even reserve the chair. And here you don't. And look at this beautiful view. Gorgeous, gorgeous beach. more of the hammocks. Now I'm going to take you guys over to the pool area. Which if you have this beach, in my opinion, you don't really even need a pool. Because I'd rather be at the beach. But if you bring kids with you, they probably want to be at the pool. But look at this nice walk. Walk along here. You can walk for miles. Right? Yeah, you I walked, walked yeah, you went pretty far. I couldn't even see him anymore. I don't know where he had gone. <laughs> the hospitality here has been great. Um, everybody's been really nice. Oh, so yeah, they gave you the flags to let you know. I'll show you guys the sign. The condition of the waves. Um, they do have lifeguards, I believe they told us yesterday. I don't see them today though. Could be because they don't want you to go to the water. Oh no, there is no lifeguard. Uh, the green, calm conditions, yellow, kind of rough, and ragged is uh, dangerous, so that's where we're at today. So, I guess it's kind of too much your risk. But they recommend that you don't. So, I would listen to them. We're at the sort of pool, we're about at the beach. Yeah, we can do that. Oh no, we'll show the pool real quick since we're here. So, again, the views are just amazing. I love a good view, peaceful view. This is the pool area they have for you to shower, two spots. Again, all the free chairs, plenty of room. There's one of the pools. Um, this one is called, I think it's called Fabaya, and it's um, a swim swim bar. So you can get drinks and stuff while you're in the pool, which is always really cool. That's a big plus. And now we'll head and show you the beach. I don't even know if you knew about that, the swim up bar over there. Yeah. So my tips, if you've never been to Puerto Rico, is to bring your sunglasses, your sunscreen, and your sun hat. Because uh, it's hot. A lot of sun. I mean, and I, the heat is my thing. I love it. This is perfect weather for me. But if you're not used to it, it's, it's hot from the moment you wake up. And it doesn't go away. <laughs> Yeah, you can see the waves. So I, I don't really like to go in the ocean and forget if you're gonna see me in there today with the waves like that. I'm more of a lay in the sun and soak up the sun person. But look how gorgeous. Lots of seashells in the sand. Sinking into the sand. Take you on a little walk with us on the beach. Huh? Take it close okay. to the water. You take that too? And
gets deep pretty fast. It gets deep pretty fast. It's like, you see what I'm right now? I'm gonna fly in there. <laughs> Like speak again, like 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 right here, huh? Oh. Closet comes with ironing board, iron, safe, extra uh, bedding, hangers, um, and they do have laundry service. <clears throat> this is our uh, king bed. Yeah. King bed. It has um, charging station on both sides, lamp on both sides, and a little drawer on both sides. I like that feature. A lot of times you go to a room and they just have the charging station on one side of the bed, so I love it when they're on both sides. Um, another little dresser, again, like I said, we've been here a day, a, a night, so it's a little lived in. Um, ice bucket, some glasses, four more drawers, a desk, the TV. I liked that it can swivel, so whether we're in the bed watching TV or on this cute little couch. I'm not sure what this shaped couch is called, but I think it's a really cute design. Over here is your air and heating. If you're in Puerto Rico, you're not going to use any heating. Um, and this cool door opens up, and there's your microwave and your fridge. Typical little mini fridge. We have some water and some fruit in there. Um, that's nice. Always a plus for me when the room has a fridge and a microwave, especially if you're with kids or a baby. That's very convenient. A little coffee station. Um, I believe this is like a Okay, so it's not like a Keurig, it's you actually pour the coffee grounds in there. Um, so in case you, or somebody likes to bring in pots with you, it does not take that. Now the little lighting. And now here, we have our balcony. There is no screen, which is something I wish it did have. But it has a table, seating for two. And again, another view, this amazing view. So you can have your breakfast, lunch out here, or just sit out here at night. Hear the waves, but what you actually hear is the airplanes because we are very close. There's one right there. 
perfect timing. We are five minutes from the airport. So actually at this point, we've been here maybe 24 hours? Or a little less than 24 hours. And I'm already used to it. Like it doesn't bother me like it did yesterday where it was kind of shaking and super loud. I almost didn't even notice it now. And we're, all, we're also by the highway. So considering highway and the airport, I still feel pretty at peace and it's very calming here. And I can still hear the waves. I can clearly hear the waves. So, like I said, at first it might take it by surprise, like, oh wow, we're super close to the airport. But I'm used to it already. And even almost forgot that we were at, by the airport. And then you have the two sliding glass doors. So again, I wish it had a screen, but you got two sliding glass doors to help keep the noise out. Um, so that's it. That's the tour of our room. And so this is, what is this room called? A King Ocean View? Ocean slash pool view, king size room. So if that was the kind of room you're looking for, this is what it looks like. Plenty of room for us, have everything we need. Like I said, big plus if you have kids that has a microwave and um, fridge, because I know it's important, especially if you have babies and you got milk and all that kind of stuff, you need a fridge and not all. There's our tap fridge, so that's a big bonus. Uh, it does have adjoining rooms, it's just us, but if you came with others, it does have the option for the adjoining rooms. The yeah, that could just be our room, but the walls are a little thin. We heard our neighbors next door just having regular conversation. <laughs> um, so that and the screen would be yeah. my two things. But I mean, if those are your two complaints, I don't think that's that big of a deal. So yeah. wanted to give our review of our stay. Um, we stayed five days. Yeah. Um, arrived in the evening on the first day um, and had a, a dinner. Sit outside by the pool. Oh, uh, pool by and the beach. Ocean. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, <clears throat> our first impression, we liked it right away. Yeah. Um, smooth was great. Smooth was great. Food was good. Service was amazing. Yeah. Um, woke up the next day. And checked out the beach a little more. Had breakfast um, more. Had, oh yeah, breakfast. Mentioned earlier that we had the option we got the free breakfast package. Um, breakfast was always good. It's a buffet style. Um, lots of variety. Again, service was great. They have a, a bar that's right by the beach that is open at least like 11 to 11. Yeah. Um, Every person we encountered at that bar was so nice. Um, considering they are extremely busy, work very hard, they still smile at every single person, um, take good care of you. Um, they have food there as well to go or to eat here. Um, <clears throat> um, other things about this the hotel, the resort is beautiful. Yeah. Besides the, the beach view, the resort itself is very nice. Um, they have a volleyball court, they have um, hammocks. hammocks, yeah. Um, they have chairs, they bring out food with umbrellas. <clears throat> massages. Uh, oh yeah, massages. You can see how much the pasta but they right. do have that. Yeah, and they're here almost the whole entire day. Yeah. Um, what else? Um, um, all the food we ate here, I feel was great. Yeah. It's a real good, nice variety from Puerto Rican to American, you know, fries, everything. Um, I'm getting a little bit out here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's the one thing. There's some bugs out here that man, I know, but they, they warn you about. And yeah. this brings maybe it's like a... Uh, Bug spray. Yeah. They do have some, 
But if you don't want to have to keep asking them, you know, you can bring your own. Yeah. Uh, kind of feels like a like a mosquito or something yeah. would be, you know, getting at you. I don't see any marks or anything, but you can feel them. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> That's not really a resort problem. You're right, right. Yeah, yeah. Um, um, resort is clean. Um, our room itself, I thought it was nice and big. Yeah. Um, balcony, our view was beautiful. Yeah. Our only complaint with the room is that how the walls are. Yeah. Um, our neighbors next door were, um, they play music pretty late into the morning when they would come in. And we could hear their entire conversation. Yeah. Like if they were in the room with us. Um, luckily that was not like an all day thing, yeah. but it did wake us up twice in the night because they were, they would come in late and, uh, have a little party in their room. Um, any other complaints? No, 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 no. complaints about the place here. Yeah, yeah I, I think that was it. And yeah. again, that's not the resort's fault yeah. necessarily, um, but just be aware. And it could just be our room. Yeah. Ours was an adjoining room. Yeah. So maybe request not to have an adjoining room. Maybe the walls are not so thin. Yeah. We're really getting fit out here. At least I am. So we have stayed at quite a few hotels, quite a few resorts, yes. and I think this is that on our top. Yeah, this is our top.